through 6. Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in the firmament of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the psaltery and harp. Praise him with the tuba and band. Praise him with the string instruments and organ. Praise him upon the loud cymbal. Praise him upon the high sounding cymbal. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Praise ye the Lord. Let the church say amen. And we thank our sister for reading that beautiful scripture. Praise ye the Lord. Now, that's what we came to do this morning, to praise and give God the praises where our praises do. And we're going to sing an old song that we, most of us know this song. We want to open up and sing it. Amazing grace, how sweet it sounds. Amazing grace. been all that good. We have sinned and we come short of thy holy word. But, oh God, you said in thy word to ask and thou shall be given. Seek ye and he shall find. Knock and the doors will be open. We ask indeed to forgive us for our many sins. Help us to walk in the light. For you said, ye are the light of the world, the salt of the earth. Oh, help us to walk in the light. Oh, please uh, look and have mercy upon us. We need thee every hour. We need thee every step of the way. Just can't get along without you. Realize, oh God, what you can't do just cannot be done. Oh, please, sir, have mercy upon him. Bless our service this day, oh God. You know, God, one day praying deeds will be over. We don't know when, we don't know where, but one day it all will be over. Oh, please, sir, have mercy upon us. When we prayed our last prayer, we have sung our last song in that great getting up morning. And there will be no more, no more problem. Be joy, peace, happiness forever. In that great getting up morning. Want to see Jesus in that great getting up morning. Want to see all of my sisters and brothers in that great getting up morning. My mother will be waiting, my father too, in that great getting up morning, just walk around heaven, walk around heaven, just walk around heaven all day, shake hands with the elders, 
in that great getting up morning, receive our soul into thy kingdom. That there will be joy, joy in that great getting up morning. Receive our soul into thy kingdom. This is our prayer. Amen. Amen. Jesus getting us ready for that great day. Jesus getting us ready for that great day. Oh, Jesus getting us ready for that great day. Well, who shall be able to stand? Well, the righteous will be marching on that. Yeah, the righteous will be marching on that great day. Righteous will be marching on that great day. Oh, who shall be able to stand? Don't you know that sinners are going to be running on that? Yeah, yeah sinners are going to be running on that. Well, sinners are going to be running on that. Well, who shall be able to stand? Oh, don't you want to be ready on that? Yeah, don't you want to be ready on that? Well, don't you want to be ready on that? Yeah, who shall be able to stand? Well, he got my mother ready for that. Yeah, he got my mother ready on that. Yes, he got my mother ready for the great day. Who shall be able to stand? I tell you, Jesus getting us ready. I just shall see. God, uh, uh, take me to the water, take me to the water, uh, take me to the water. Say it again, uh, uh, take me to the water, uh, take me to the water, oh Lord, take me to the water.
Well, I know I've got religion. I know I've got religion. I know I've got religion. I've been baptized. Everybody say this with me. Uh, I love Jesus. Do you love him today? I love Jesus. I love Jesus. Oh, yes, I do. As we sang a familiar song that we've been singing for unteen years at the cross. Praise the Lord. Uh, it all started for us at the cross. Amen. Now, it is our benevolent offering time. We're going to ask that you would kindly participate and give in this offering that is designed 
to go out and bless somebody else. Amen. The Lord told us to help bear the infirmities of the weak. And this is a part of that commandment. Here you go. Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor sitteth in the seat of the scornful. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law doth he meditate day and night. And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. His leaf also shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. The ungodly are not so, but are like the chaff which the wind driveth away. Therefore, the ungodly shall not stand in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For the Lord knoweth the way of the righteous, but the way of the ungodly shall perish. The more he gives to you, mm -hmm. keep on because it's really, really true. Oh, you, mm hmm. Lord, we thank you right now for this offering. We pray that you would bless those that gave and those that desired to give but did not have. Let it go out to bless someone's life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. No matter how oh, you try, uh -huh. no matter No matter how you try, oh yeah. No matter, no matter how you try, Jesus. Everybody ought to know Jesus. Oh, he is Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. It's good to know. It's good to know Jesus. Everybody ought to know Jesus. Oh, Why try to rise? I'll hate to 
to know Jesus. Oh, he's the lily of the valley. My bright and morning star is good to know. Oh, I came to Jesus just as I was. I was weary, worn, and so sad. Oh, but I found it a hymn. A sweet old resting place, and he has made me glad. Oh, it's good to know Jesus. Everybody ought to know Jesus. Oh, he's a lily of the valley. My bright and morning star is good. It's good to know the Lord. It's good to know him. It's good to know the Lord. It's good to know him. It's good to know the Lord. Woke me up this morning. Started me on my way. He put food on my table. The Lord is willing and able. A doctor in a sick room. A lawyer in a courtroom. It's good to know the Lord. It's good to know the Lord. It's good to know him. It's good to know the Lord. Oh, he's the lily of the valley. My bright and morning star. It's good to know. No. Let everyone say amen. 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 You can know theology and you can know psychology and you can know all of these ologies, but it's just good to know the Lord. Amen. A a amen. I I because God is what? God is a spirit and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. I don't care how much you read, but you still need to know him, amen, in the pardons of your sin, amen, amen. God bless you. God keep you. We are now going to move forward. We thank God for what has transpired at this particular time, amen, so far, amen, baptism service, amen, and Good singing, amen. Man, they brought one of them songs out. I think it was the first Sunday I ever came here. Amen. 2004, amen. Amen, amen. God bless you. Sister McClain, you still sound the same. Amen. 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 It, it, it's good to know the Lord, amen. 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 Some of your famous singers, they lost it before they left. Amen. 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 At this particular time, uh, we're going to ask that you prepare now for our litany of giving. For now, this is the offertory period that we share here at Macedonia where we give according to to what the word of God has yes, said unto us. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And if you will turn into the midst of your bulletin, you will find the litany of giving. Amen. amen. On a separate, amen, sheet of paper. Amen. Amen. Thank God for paper. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Litany of giving. Coming from 1 Corinthians 16, 
1 through 2 out of the New Living Translation concerning the collection for Jerusalem. Verse 1, let us read together. Now regarding your question about the money being collected for God's people in Jerusalem, you should follow the same procedure I gave to the churches in Galatia. On the first day of each week, you should each put aside a portion of the money you have earned. Don't wait until I get there and then try to collect it all at once. St. Luke 638, the New Living Translation, verse 38. Give and you will receive. Your gift will return to you in full. Press down, shaken together to make room for more running over and poured into your lap. The amount you give will determine the amount you get back. We're going to ask our urchers and officers to come at this time. Let everyone bow their head. Eternal God, our gracious, heavenly, loving Father, Lord, once again, we come in your presence, giving you praise and glory for all you've done. Gracious Father, in the name of Jesus, we ask that you bless this offering. We ask you bless those that gave and those that couldn't at this time, Lord. We ask you to see that this offering is used for the purpose it was given. We ask you this in Jesus' name, and let every heart say amen. amen. I really think it's only befitting that this week, we will funeralize one of the Bay Area's own, that's Edwin Hawkins. And as many of you know, Edwin Hawkins wrote many, many songs, including Oh Happy Day, Thank You, Lord, for One More Day. Uh, he collaborated with his brother Walter to write the song that we're about to sing, Jesus Christ is the Way. And I've worked with Edwin since 1969 we all at that time there was no big eyes and little you we were just all singing together just singing in this bay area he had a he had a choir called the northern state youth choir which was out of the church of god in christ during session the geo beffers was geo beffers specials was just starting out in 1969 the voices of christ and the helen stevens started out in 1969 so we all kind of came around at the same time. Right. And he, besides a brilliant songwriter, he had one of the most beautiful personalities you ever wanted to meet. Amen. He was a proficient musician. I remember years and years ago, we used to get in my uncle's gold 67 GTO <laughs> and go across the bridge to Ephesians Church of God in Christ just to hear him play. He was just that fantastic. He did so much for the Bay Area because when he did Oh Happy Day, he put the Bay Area on the map. All right, all right. And we owe him that today. So as we and other churches around the country, many people are coming in for the funeral. On, it's going to be uh, Tuesday night and Wednesday night. As we, amongst the other churches in the country, 
that are doing a little special tribute for him on today because those kind of minds come once in a lifetime. So we give our tribute today as we sing, Jesus Christ is the way. Whoa! 
Jesus Christ is the way. Isn't it good to get a reminder that Jesus Christ is the way? Amen. How many of you know he's the way? His way is the best way. It's the right way. And guess what? He'll always take us all the way. What a blessing to realize and reflect on the way of Christ. Amen. In our lives. Jesus Christ. Amen. That's not a watered down saying either. That's straight and to the point. Amen. Amen. Praise him. Praise him. From the rising of the sun until the going down of the same, our God is worthy to be praised. I said he's worthy to be. After you look back over our lives, think about where he brought us from, where he has taken us to, what he has delivered us from. We can say thank you, Lord. Lord, we thank you. We thank you. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ is the way. Jesus Christ is the truth. Jesus Christ is the life. Let us look to the Lord in prayer. Eternal God, our gracious, most loving Heavenly Father, we thank you for what our eyes have seen and our ears have heard and our hearts have felt on this day. Thank you for our candidates. Thank you for Sister J. Robinson and little brother Jeremiah. We thank you that they accepted the Lord Jesus as their personal Savior. And all they did was show outwardly what has already taken place inwardly. When they went into the water, they, they died to the old life. They were put down as Jesus was laid in the grave. But then they got up in the newness of life as an identification that they are believers. We thank you for their new life journey. It starts today. Today is the first day of the rest of their Christian life. We thank you now for them. We pray that we be examples for them. Uh, that we reflect what you have already taught us and continue to teach us. So we just ask that you bless them, bless their lives, bless their families. We know that the first line of defense for Satan is to plant doubt in their life that God is not able to save them. But we know that he's real and that he's already saved them. And we thank you. Bless this day in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 We thank God today because this is a super Sunday. And I'm not referring to what's coming on on the TV this afternoon. It's super because we got a super God that looked beyond all of our faults and have seen each and every one of our needs. Praise the Lord today. We, um, are just so happy that you all are here. Uh, we do want to uh, continue uh, in prayer for, first of all, let me just thank uh, Reverend Batten, amen, for making sure that everything is taken care of, amen. Thank God for him, the deacons, the deaconess. Everybody seems to be Mother Holland's on their post, and that is beautiful. Amen. Let's give them a hand clap of praise. Amen. Amen. And you know, amen, that's what a good church is, is about. Amen. Where people, amen, knowing uh, their, their responsibility, staying in their lane, and watching God work. Amen. Amen. Thank God for Sister Savoy. She uh, uh, hit a home run today in Sunday school. Amen. Praise the Lord. And, Amen. Brother Greenwood teaching. Amen. Hit, a, hit another home run. Um, it's just a lot of great things are happening. 
Amen. When we just get out of the way, amen, stop criticizing folk, talking about people, amen, just let God have his way. You talking about having some church. I say you talking about having some church. Amen, amen, amen. Because, uh, you know, in God's house, there, there is no big eyes and little U's. We're all in this together. Amen. Amen. When we find ourselves too much in it, that lets us know we too much in it. And we need to step back. Amen. Praise the Lord. So we thank God um, for what has happened on today. I want you to just be in prayer with me and for me. Um, on next Saturday, late Saturday evening, we'll be uh, taking a flight to uh, New York. And then after that, uh, we'll be uh, flying to uh, Jerusalem, uh, to Tel Aviv. <coughs> and um, this is uh, uh, going to be a pilgrimage to the Holy Land. Um, we're thanking God for the opportunity to go. Um, just... Uh, it's it's just unexplainable um, the what I'm about to uh, experience and um, have a little you you gotta pray for me I have a little anxiety um, you know uh, leaving the country and my children you know many of you know that I I take them to school pick them up still do it. Amen. And, uh, you know, a parent, you know, I just don't want to get uh, emotional, uh, but it, it, it is working on me being away from them. But I know that God's going to take care of them. Amen. Um, you know, and uh, like I said, you know, when you go into the Middle East, we know that things are not as, you know, great over there. Uh, but I just praise God that the Lord will allow me to go and come back. Amen. I told you on the other week, I said I, I had already mailed my insurance premium already. <laughs> Amen. Well, hey, we, you, 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 you chuckling, but hey, that's, you know, you, something happened to me. And then they look, uh, you know, and talk about, well, your, 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 your insurance have lapsed. Amen. No, no, no. I had to put that thing in the mail. <laughs> Amen. Make sure. Amen. Because uh, anything happened to me, I want to make sure that I, that I took care of business. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. So God bless you. God keep you. Many of you don't know Brother McLean had lost his sister last week. And on yesterday at Dugan's uh, Sierra Mortuary, we funeralized uh, the, uh, uh, his sister, Sister Diana Lee Kittling. And we know that that uh, is his sister and that's also the granddaughter uh, to the late uh, Deacon and Sister J.R. Wiley. Amen. And so we represented Macedonia yesterday, I believe, Deacon and Sister Wade. And and, uh, and, and I know many of you may not have known. Amen. But uh, we just want to let you know that you was well represented. And we know that your prayers were there. Amen. Amen. And so uh, Pastor Kenneth uh, R. Reese of the Cornerstone Baptist Church preached a tremendous message. And he encouraged the family to keep on keeping on. So we want to be in prayer for Sister um, Maurice and, uh, and, and Sister Viola McLean. Amen. God bless you. Let us look into the word now. Uh, we again want to encourage, amen, Sister Robinson and little, little Jeremiah, amen, that they are growing disciples of Jesus, growing disciples disciples of Jesus. I want you to look with me at Philippians chapter 3 for a moment. Philippians third chapter 17th verse and then I want us to take a look at 1 John chapter 2 and verse 6 where we'll first look at we're looking first of all uh, Lamont we're going to be looking at Philippians 3 and 17. <laughs> Amen. Lamont, that's my friend. Amen. Amen. That fella, he, he, he's bought, bought me several pairs of, of shoes and ties, suits. So I, I, can, I can tell Lamont where we're at in the scripture. Amen. Uh, Philippians chapter 3, verse 17. 
And again, church fam, it's good to have relation, good relationships with folk. Amen. If you, if you can't learn how to get along with folk after 15 years, shame on you. Say amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. I looked at how Pastor Reese and how he has such a beautiful relationship with his members at Cornerstone. And, you know, when I see other pastors, I say, wow, I want to be just like that. I want to have relationships. Amen. Uh, the third chapter, the 17th verse of Philippians, chapter 3, verse 17. And watch this. When I say have good relationships, I don't mean that we all have to agree all the time. But that we learn how to be disagree. We can disagree, amen, without being disagreeable. Having that, that kind of attitude. Amen. Look at what he said. Look what he said. Verse 17 of Philippians chapter 3. He said, brethren, be followers together of me and mark them which walk so as ye have us for an example. Basically, he says, he says, he who, he says, watch this, brethren, be followers together of me and mark them which walk so as ye have us as an example. Watch this in verse 18. For many walk of whom I have told you often and now tell you even weeping that they are the enemies of the cross of Christ. Verse 19, whose end is destruction, who God is is their belly and whose glory is in their shame, who mine earthly things. I'm going to stop right there. I want us to go to 1 John real quick. 1 John chapter 2. And look at verse number 6. Hallelujah. I say hallelujah. And in 1 John chapter 2 and verse 6 says, He that saith he abideth in him ought himself also so to walk, even as he walked. Watch this again. He who says he abides in him ought himself also to walk just as he walked. I just want to talk from this subject today. Follow my example. Follow my example. Now, my brothers and sisters, I want you to...